The goat is dead. Sometimes there are trails that come to define a trail system. For Battle Creek, that trail is called the goat. It's a short trail, real short. It only descends 130 feet, but it has things that are lacking on other Twin Cities trails. A sustained downhill with fun jumps and an honest to God fast technical root and rock section. So, if the goat is so good, why change it? In a word, sand. If you've been riding the goat regularly over the past few years, you've seen the problems. The rut at the beginning of the trail was growing bigger and bigger and more tree roots were starting to show through. Water would run from the top of the trail, depositing sand before and after each of the jumps and at the bottom of the tree step down. This was an untenable situation for a public trail in a county park. Changes had to be made if this trail was going to be able to stay open. Like at the bottom of that tree step down, we dug down three feet before we hit black dirt. This is Adam Buck, owner of Pathfinder Trails. Mm -hmm. And black dirt is your is the natural. So I mean, sand was washing from up trail right. in the last like, I think the last big redo is 2012 or 2013. Yeah. And in 2012, 2013, they were going to close the trail. Yeah. He and his crew were tasked with the goat rehab. And uh, we're putting a new entrance on, which will add like 300 feet maybe. And it'll give you the whole elevation of the hill because we're at the very top now. And then we're going to fix the features on the way down, punch in more aggressive drains, clean out the sand. Um, and then we're going to actually extend the trail down to the road at the bottom. Uh, is that Lower Afton? Uh, yep, Lower Afton. Yeah, so we're going to extend the trail down to Lower Afton. And um, there'll be a new return loop coming over there. And then I like the burn we put in at the bottom. Yeah. I think like the ending before to me was always kind of like, it was fun. It was yeah. straight and fast. Yeah. But I think now, I mean, like, you're gonna be able to rail that thing. Yeah. It's a little bit soft right now, right. but I think once it hardens up, that's gonna be. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, it's like yeah. it's almost vertical at the top. So yeah. I mean, it's like, it's good. It's yeah. good. There's no berms like this out here, or I, I think honestly, really in the metro. Yeah. Okay, that's interesting and all, but I'm sure everyone has the same question: How does it ride? Well, all I can say is, long live the goat. rehab isn't fully done yet. As of this recording on April 15th, 2020, there was still a couple hundred feet of trail left to uh, be finished. It was gonna, it's gonna be extended down to Lower Afton Road. But before this last snowstorm, uh, the trail was open and it's gonna be open again soon. So get out there, ride it, let me know what you think. <laughs>